So here's the tour of the Barrel XFX that I have running on my system. This is running Gen 2 Linux. And uh, first thing is, as you can see, I have a lot of windows open. So uh, if I want to pick a window real fast, I can just go up. They all use a feature pioneered by one particular operating system a couple years ago. Pick that, comes right to the top. Very easy way to keep in charge of all the windows you're having. Now Linux is famous for having multiple desktops, and this is no different. I actually have four running, I only have stuff on two of them. Now if you'll notice, when I do that effect, the cube goes somewhat uh, transparent. Actually, it's a cube. Let me show you the cube. Here it is. Here's all four of my desktops, all together on one big cube. Now I use four. Four is a good number for me. Uh, your number may differ, and the shape of the cube will change into shape of whatever geometric object has that many sides. And you can pull it around, and you can see this one's actually layering the windows. Uh, how they are away from the surface of the cube and you can snap back to one of them and it all settles back into what it's doing. So you can pick a window and you can bring it off to the next side of the cube just like that. It maps if you have it halfway in the cube pretty nicely. It does that fun corner effect which is interesting. Also gives you really quick ability to make a window transparent. As you can see when I move this it becomes a little bit transparent and then goes back or I could just make it really transparent quickly like that and that window is still there it's hard to see but it's still there it's still valid it's still a real window it's just a little bit transparent I could do that to all of them and then look you start seeing the background emerge in the back of course that would be very very difficult to manage those are some of the Barrel X effects I have running on my system. This is all 3D accelerated. And uh, thank you for watching.